In this video, we are going to build our about us page. So you come to our site manager, uh, you click on our site here, create a new blank page, right click on it and change this to about us. So let's move this up. And um, now you double click on it and make sure we are on the about us page. Let's right click on an empty space, go to page properties and set the alignment to center, that center horizontally. Now let's come back to the services page and copy this to, uh, let's just copy this layer and copy this master object we have in here. Come back to the master page and let's just paste that here. Now we'll come back to the services page, copy this to layers we have in here. Come back to the about us and make sure we paste in place using Control shift v so now let's change the um image here so we come to styles we come to browse and um, select the right for image it's this one now we double click on this we don't change the image but we rather change the position of the image so this is going to be i think the bottom yes so the bottom we go ahead and click on ok so we have the track showing over there now we are going to change the test we have in here. So I'm going to copy a test from my final project and I'm going to paste that in here. So I'm pasting that here. I'm going to select the appropriate style for this one. This is going to be 11 gray and this is going to be our 18 black bold. And we are going to change the size of our layer here. So this is going to be 970 by 409 pixels. I'll go ahead and click on OK. So that is it over here now let's make sure we apply our master page to this particular page so we go to miscellaneous and select our master page let's come back to general and change this to about s let's go ahead and click on ok and um, let's change that for the services page as well so let's change this to services i'll go ahead and click on ok now let me come back to the about s page let me hit on f5 to preview the page and as you can see we have everything in it um, rightful place here now let's come back to our project we are going to continue with the fact page all i need to do is to let me just duplicate this page so i'll clone this page right click on this change this to fact and i'm um, just going to move this up i'm double clicking on this and i'm going to change the height of my layer here so the height is going to be 670 pixels i'm going to get rid of this test and i'm going to copy the actual test from the final project i'm going to paste that in here i'll move this a little bit to the top let me just get a rightful position so the position is going to be 21 by 337 um, pixels let me make sure i apply the appropriate styles to them so the appropriate styles have been applied to our test we have in here now let's preview this page and uh, make sure everything is correct so we have our fact page and uh, let's just go back and change the title of the page so this is going to be frequently asked questions so we are going to change this to frequently questions let's just copy that and um, use that for this here let's go ahead and click on ok and um, preview it again in our browser so as you can see, we have our frequently asked questions page showing very well. Now let's continue with the contact page. So all I need to do is to duplicate this page, right click on it and make sure I set this to contact. Let me just make this contact S. Now double click on this page, come to it, right click on an empty space, change the title of the page to contact S as well as copy it and paste it for the menu name i'll go ahead and click on ok and i'm going to get rid of my test i have in here so i'm going to get rid of this test and i'm going to copy the actual test from the final project so i'm going to copy that and i'm going to paste that in here now i'm going to get it rightful position so this is 21 by 337 pixels i'm going to do that here and now what I'm supposed to do next is to build the contact form. But before then, let me expand the size of this layer from um, its original size to that is a 758 pixels. In the next video, we are going to take a look at how to build our contact form here. 